John 1 verse 1 to 3 says, In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. He was in the beginning with God, and all things were made through Him, and without Him nothing that was made was made. In this, we find comfort when we know our origins. We find comfort when we know who begins the world. It is not matter that begins the world. For matter itself requires a cause. And God is that cause that begins the world. It was not the mind of a scientist that began the world. For the mind of a scientist is also a created being. It also needs something behind a created being. It was not, oh, it was not the law that begins the world. For law is just an order an order of things that controls those that are created. Therefore, it cannot be the law that begins the world because the law itself requires a creator. It is God. God who is an unmovable mover, who gives the world a meaning, who moves the world, a world of time, a world that requires someone outside time to control time. Therefore, God can change our predicaments into achievements. God can change our triumphs into achievement. He is the only one, only one who can change our situations. For one writer says, whenever we are faced with a situation, a situation that seems so hard, a situation that seems like it cannot change. Oh, brothers and sisters, allow me to say, sometimes the situation does not need to change. It is us who need to change because some situations are there so they can change you and me. It is when God sent the Israelites to the Babylonian exile that Babylon was a situation that was not there to, to, to be changed, but it was a situation that was there to change the children of Israel. Because God says to them, unless and unless the 70 years of Babylon are finished, uh, enjoy, stay there in Babylon. Before the 70 years are over, nothing shall change. Therefore, whatever situation that you might be facing right now, just know that there is a God who can speak to nothing and it can, it can become something. Just know that there is a God who controls time for the world It's on its own is a world of time. Everything doesn't stay permanent in a world of time. Everything has got its own time. Therefore, whatever that you are facing, it has got its own time. It shall expire because we save a God who controls time. We serve a God who speaks things into existence. For the God that we serve is not a God that talks about our situation. He is not like human beings that when you tell them your problems, they will talk about them. When you tell God your problems, He does not talk about your problems, but He speaks life into your situations. He speaks things into your nothingness. That is the God that we serve. May we be comforted and may we have peace in this God. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.